Hello again, my name is John and welcome to my new video. In this short video I'll be opening the traditional cheddar cheese I made back in January. You can see the video of me making this cheddar cheese on my channel. As you can see in the video I made this cheese on the 25th of January and the cheddar would be ready from the 25th of July. The actual day I'm opening it is the 21st of September so it's been maturing for an extra couple of months. OK, I'll start by cutting open the vacuum packing and get the cheese out into the open air for the first time in 8 months. The cheese feels dry to the touch, there's no moisture at all, which is a good sign. Now I'll cut the wheel in half and see what it looks like on the inside. Right, now the cheese has been cut open, it has a nice crumbly dry texture, which is exactly what you want from good cheddar. A nice pale yellow colour and it smells wonderful. It has a pleasant cheese odour and it looks absolutely great. OK, it's ticked all the boxes so far, so now we just need to know what it tastes like. Before tasting the cheese, I need to peel off the protective coating that I applied before vacuum packing it, as an extra precaution against mould. It peels off pretty easily, just like paper. OK, now that's done I can get down to tasting it. I'll start by cutting off a slab and cut a strip from about the middle of that piece and that's the bit I'll test. First impressions it has a great creamy texture, not gritty at all like some cheddars you buy. The flavour isn't mild and on the other hand it isn't strong either. It has a really pleasant and unmistakably cheddary taste. I'm very pleased with it. If you prefer a stronger cheddar, I recommend you age it for about a year. For a mild cheese, six months, and anywhere in between for various flavours. If it's not strong enough for your taste, you can always re-vacuum pack it and age it for a little longer. Well, that's it for this taste test. You can see how I made this cheddar cheese by hitting the link on screen. You can also check out my other cheese, bread and cake recipes on my channel. OK, everyone. That's about it, so until the next time, thanks very much for watching and bye for now.